Hi Aries, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. Um, today we're going to be doing you guys' general love reading, okay? And please keep in mind these are general, so take what resonates and leave what doesn't, okay, y'all? If this does not resonate with you, feel free to look at your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. Maybe those will resonate with you guys more, okay? Now, to my... Um, so my old subscribers, y'all know that I have been gone literally for like almost a month, but your girl is back, okay, I had a lot of good time, I spent a lot of fun, what, I spent a lot of fun, I had a good time, okay y'all, I had a good time on my vacation, okay, and I'm so happy to be back, because I missed y'all, like, your girl missed y'all. But to my new subscribers, um, welcome. You guys are going to love my channel, okay? I hope you guys subscribe to my channel, okay? Because you're not going to want to miss out on my videos, and you're not going to regret it, okay? So, let's get into the reading. We're going to look into your person to see how they feel about you, and then we're going to see how you feel about them, okay? So, let's see. How does this person feel about my Aries? How does this person currently feel about my Aries for June 2021? How does this person feel about my Aries for June 2021, Spirit? How does this person currently feel about my Aries for June 2021? Okay, we have the High Priestess. All right, could we do with a Pisces? Somebody here is trusting their intuition. Okay, not really telling you much. Okay, the Three of Wands. All right, could be dealing with a fire sign. Okay, so the energy that I'm getting here is that somebody here, Aries, is hiding something from you. Like, that's the energy. Somebody here is hiding something. They're not really expressing to you what they're doing or how they're feeling. Okay, this person is sitting back, watching, contemplating, waiting. And planning something okay I feel like also this person could have been very secretive like they you probably asked this person to tell you how they feel or you just wanted this person to be vulnerable with you but they were never doing that okay the knight of wands this person could be dealing with another fire sign um okay the knight of wands this person is has a lot of passion for you they want to come forward very fiery they want to come forward towards you very fast here okay and i feel like also there's a lot of sexual feelings here from this person all right could be dealing with the sagittarius is what i'm getting okay the knight of wands it also talks about attraction so this person also finds you to be very attractive okay The Three of Swords. Hmm. Okay, so there was a heartbreak here. This person, I feel like they've caused you to have a lot of, they, okay, I'm sorry, y'all. This person caused a lot of pain in this connection between the two of you. And how they're feeling about you is that they are trusting their intuition. They, they are, um... This person is planning, I feel like, to come forward, to come back to you, okay? This could be somebody from your past. This could be an ex who you're dealing with, all right? But I feel like this person is planning to come back, Aries, okay? Because now they want you. They want to be with you. They want to reconcile. They want to they wanna see you. They want to talk to you, okay? And I feel like what they want to talk to you about is this Three of Swords energy. The fact that this person has caused you to have a lot of heartbreak. They put a lot of pain on you, okay? They want to come back and they want to apologize is what I'm getting as well, okay? But they're taking their time. They're not rushing, okay? Spirit, how does this person feel about my Aries for June 2021? We have the five of pentacles you are making this person feel left out in the cold y'all like this person is feeling left out from you like you you could be focusing on yourself or just being independent or 
just not even worrying about this person, not even chasing after them. And it's literally blowing this person's mind. Like, it's making them go crazy, Aries, that you are not giving them any attention, okay? You are making them feel like they're not worthy anymore. Like, they don't mean anything, okay? And this is why they want to come back in because they see how unbothered you are. They see you just not even focusing on them. Like, you are just living your best life. You could be on social media, probably on vacation somewhere, posting so much pictures and this person is seeing that and this is why they want to come back in because they are feeling left out they're like they feel left out they feel like you don't love them anymore you don't care about them because you are just focusing on yourself and that's like that's not a problem at all Aries like everybody should be focusing on themselves but it's like this person they just can't seem to let go of you they don't like that you are leaving them out in the cold okay yeah, look, it's get, it's making this person very mad, y'all. <laughs> with the Nine of Swords, this person is starting to get very mad with the Nine of Swords, okay? They're, like, they're getting angry, y'all. <laughs> the fact that you are leaving them out in the cold is making them go crazy, okay? And I feel like the more they wait, the more, the more angry, the more anger they get, okay? Because they want you. They're tired of waiting, y'all. Like, they can't do it anymore. Damn, Aries, what y'all got this person doing? Y'all got this person going crazy, literally. <laughs> okay. Yeah, look, we have the world in the reverse. There was an ending in this connection is what I'm getting here, okay? Could be dealing with the Scorpio, all right? There was an ending here. And now they want to come back in. They want to fix things up with you. Yeah, temperance. Could be doing what they said to tell you. This person is wanting to balance things out. They want to work things out with you. They want to come together. They want to apologize to you about whatever happened. Because this person just wants to make sure that you guys are happy. You guys are back together. You, you know, they don't want to fight. They don't want to go back and forth with you. Like, this person does not want the drama, okay? And it's like... I feel like they will do anything to get you in touch and they will do anything to get you back because the, the more this person is feeling left out in the cold, the more crazy they start to get. The Knight of Swords could be dealing with a Libra or um, a Gemini or an Aquarius, an air sign, okay? Like, this, it's starting to get to this person that y'all are leaving them out in the cold, okay? And, who child. Y'all got this person going crazy, y'all. Literally, like... <laughs> All right, let's see how you guys feel about them because I'm very interested. This is a very intense reading. Okay. All right, Spirit, how does my Aries currently feel about this person? How does my Aries feel about this person, Spirit? How does my Aries feel about this person? I'm sorry, you guys. If you hear any noise in the background or just anywhere, I'm so sorry. Please do not come for me in the comments. I literally cannot control what's going on behind me. Like, I try my best to tell people to stop talking loud. I'm sorry, y'all. But just bear with me. Don't come for me in the comments, okay? That's all I'm asking. Okay, so we have the Six of Swords. Could we do it with a water sign? All right? And the Ace of Cups, okay? So I do see that you do love this person, y'all. Yeah, like, I feel like you do love them no matter what. And you have a lot of emotions for this person. Let's see, Spirit, how does my Aries feel about this person? How does my Aries currently feel about this person, Spirit? The Three of Wands, wow. So both of you guys could be waiting for each other, okay? Or maybe you feel like this person is waiting on you, like... Aries, you probably know, like, this person is waiting on you, or you could be waiting on them, or something about planning. You could be planning something, maybe planning a move towards this person, or maybe you want this person to plan and and come towards you, because I feel like there's been a lot of distance between, between the two of you, and you guys have not communicated. You guys are at a distance from one another, and I feel like you're, like, turning your back on them. Like, you guys have turned your back on each other because you guys are face to face and you guys are not communicating and I feel like you are waiting for this person okay and you're waiting for a change to happen in this connection okay spirit how does my Aries feel about this person spirit
Spirit. How does my Aries feel about this person? The um, seven of, is this the seven? Yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. The nine of wands. I, I forgot about this. <laughs> Your girl has been away for so long. Like, I literally forgot about what each card meant. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> the nine of wands. So, I feel like you guys are very guarded. Hmm. Okay. This is your energy. Three of wands and the nine of wands. It's like you guys are waiting for this person. I feel like this is your energy. You guys are waiting. Like you're waiting to see what's going to happen, how they're going to act. Like you are letting, like you, te you're testing the waters from this person, Aries. Like that's what I'm getting. You're testing the waters and you are not going to let this person come in and try to play you or do anything to, um, come against you Aries okay like this is your energy you do not want this person to play you you don't want them to break your heart again you just not with it and I feel like if you're just like if you're trying to, if you're gonna do that then don't even come in period because I'm not trying to be all up in my feelings I'm not trying to be like that if you're gonna come and play me then don't do it at all because look I love you I care about you I do want to move things forward but if you are gonna come in and play me and you're gonna come in and you know be negative in this connection then we might as well just break up and we might as well not even be together because this is not what I want like I do want to be with you I do want to move forward with you but if this is if that's the case then we might as well just break apart you know, like, that's your energy that I'm getting here. But let's see, Spirit, how does my Aries feel about this person? The Page of Swords, okay? Uh, could be dealing with an air sign, a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. All right, so you could be watching this person on social media. Okay, Aries, don't lie. Don't lie. You could be watching this person, spying on them, seeing what they're doing on social media, looking at their pictures and stuff. Or maybe you feel like this person is stalking you. All right, so I'm feeling like you could have blocked this person, but it's like you're noticing a weird account. Like you're noticing or you're having this feeling that somebody is stalking you. Like that's what I'm getting. You have a feeling somebody is stalking you, okay? Like it could have been out the blue where you saw a random account follow you or like your picture. Like who is this? And you think that it's this person, okay? We have the Chariot and the Eight of Pentacles, Cancer Energy, all right? So, yeah, I feel like you want to move forward with this person or you want this person to move forward towards you and you guys potentially work on this connection. But like I said, Aries, you do not want this person to play you. Like, you're not with their games and it's like you just want to be happy and you, you're not trying to get your heart, your heart broken again, period. Like, that's your energy. Spirit, how does my Aries feel about this person? Thank you. The Six of Cups. This is somebody from your past who you could be dealing with here. Okay, like I do believe that you want to see this person. Like you do think about them. And I feel like maybe you do want to reconcile and meet up with this person. But it's like you just hope that they do not play any games with you. Like that's the energy that I'm getting here. Okay, give me one more card, Spirit. The Strength card could be dealing with a Leo. So yeah, like I feel like... You think this person is very strong or um, like this person is very powerful in a way, okay? But I do believe that you, you Aries, is not going to let this person come and play you or do anything to manipulate this connection because you are just not with that, <laughs> that BS, okay? Like that's your energy I'm getting here. Okay, y'all, so that's going to be it for today. If it resonated with you, feel free to give this video a fat thumbs up. If you want to, um, I forgot to say this in the beginning, you guys, but if you want to book a personal reading with me, all that information is in my description box down below. Now my cash app is working, you guys. Um, and if you want to book a personal, you can cash at me. All that information is in my description box down below. And you can also PayPal me. If that is also in my description box down below. Okay, y'all, um, yeah, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single last one of you, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.